Hey everyone, I'm gonna make a little short video on how to do the stunts on series 22 of Summer Festival playlist. As you can see we have the three stunts here. I'll show you how I did it and how I'm gonna do it. Now let's see, we have here a danger sign and also a speed zone and the third one is located here, that's a speed trap. Now. I took my time today to actually look for the most cheapest car that can actually do all three of them. Now how do I do that? I go to car value and then I start looking because I know there are a lot of new people here in this game and they don't always have the credits to buy the most expensive cars or seasonal cars. So I went over to the garage and I finally found a car that can be tuned very fast and that would be the Volkswagen Touareg R50 it's 48,000 credits um, you should have enough credits to buy that car now I tuned the car to S2 the car can go about 400 I also shared my tune for that it's actually called for stunts now let's have a look at the stunt itself. First of all, let's go to the danger sign. It's a, it's a little bit of a tricky one. So here is a danger sign. What you need to do is you're gonna go here. Now there is a line that you can take that the car doesn't flip or anything. Now of course when I do my stunts on my video, I while have 50% chance I fail but that's how most people have now as you can see here there are trees if you go between those trees in a, in a straight line your car won't flip or anything so just go with this car I made it heavy I made it fast as you can see this line here and then just stay in that's this line and there you go, you see the car stays stable and it goes far enough to actually win it. So that's number one. And now I lost my downforce, now I'm probably gonna fly further away. No, that's a little joke. Okay, let's go to the next one. Here is a speed zone. So I start from this side here. The car is fast enough to actually do it, so just be careful in the corners. It's an all-wheel drive, high power. You just need to watch out for this, so go a little bit on this side. And do not, well I have 181. As you can see, I missed it. Now you can also come from this side. Uh, you need to be careful uh, on the way I did it, but then you need to start more here. If you do not want that jump at the end, and if you want to start with the jump in the front, you need to be careful that you don't go too much off track. Otherwise it doesn't count, but you can cut off a little bit of the corners. This one is, is harder, so let's try this one again on from this side. Once again, this is for the people that don't have like the fast cars like the Hoodingen RS and some other cars. Just stay enough on the right, well not like that, you can use um, rewinds. As you can see this goes wrong again, but that doesn't really matter. Well actually the best thing that I forgot to say is, go off throttle when you start jumping. That's maybe a good advice that I can give you. Um, so let's have a look.
Also in cross country, the best thing is when the car goes in the air, go off throttle. And I must be honest, I'm awake for like a half hour, so I'm pretty sleepy still. So here, go off throttle and then back on the throttle. Cut off this little piece and you have... There you go. I would have done it from the first time if I would be awake more. But this is how you do it. So from the moment the car goes in air, go off throttle. From the moment the car hits the ground, go on throttle again. Then the third one is located here. This one is not hard to do. You just go from here. Then drive a little bit to the left. As you can see, there's a big tree right in front of me. Just go left from it. You will be in one line, as you can see. I hit the fences, but that's okay. Next time the fences are gone. So once again, I'll show you. Just go fast travel here. If you don't have fast travel, you should get the house. You get it unlocked during uh, a lot of races. So just go to the left. Left from this tree. Be careful with the other tree. There's one line and this is fast enough to actually get the stunt. There you go. Now I have everything on gold. Also yesterday I did playgrounds. As you can see I'm on 94%. Here are the rest of the 6%. Um, I'll put the percentage again in the description so it's easier for you to count out if you don't have online or you have online or you don't want to do this or you don't want to do that but yet you want to have 80% just remember if I don't do uh, online adventure I also have to wait till Wednesday to actually have done all dailies to have 80% well I hope this video helped with you Finding a very, very cheap car if you don't have credits enough and how to see the line to do the big jump or the other two stunts. Hopefully you have a nice weekend and, and see you Saturday hopefully on my Twitch stream at 9.30 CST. Bye bye.